Of course, the first bad pitch might hit Shelly okay, Whitaker. Here we go. Three, two, one. Well, like I said, no runs, no hits, three errors. <laughs> and we'll have more with the parents and uh, ceremonies for our seniors in between games of today's uh, doublehead. Ladies and gentlemen, before we honor our Cavalier seniors today, Coach Shelley Whitaker and the Cavalier softball program would also like to recognize the four seniors from St. Martin's University who are playing their final games of the regular season as seniors. First day, 5'4 senior from Ferndale, Washington. Coming into today, she was hitting 336 for the Saints. Corey Wilson. Shortstop from Antioch, California, selected all-academic for the second time in her career, Alyssa Slate. A catcher from El Dorado Hills, California, selected for the third time as an all-conference academic selection, as well as an NFC All-America Scholar-Athlete last year, Jackie Schmeling. And a senior from Sparks, Nevada, leading the team with a 4.15 average coming into today. First team all-conference selection a year ago, Mary Detling. Congratulations to the Saints seniors and good luck. Ladies and gentlemen, we now would like to recognize the seven Cavalier graduates who will be playing their last regular season home game this afternoon. Head coach Shelley Whitaker, coaching staff and team will congratulate these seven outstanding student athletes. First up, Tracy Crawlard, accompanied by her mom Darcy, her dad Dennis, and her brother Travis. The 2016 Academic all GNAC selection has played in over 60 games during her career in the Navy and White. This season, she scored a run in 10 different games. Last season, Tracy also scored 10 runs and had a stolen base to go with her six runs in 2015. Tracy Crawlard. <laughs> Next up, Lauren Warner, accompanied by Doug and Kimberly Warner. A three-year letter winner named to the academic all-GNAC team last season. This season, she's played in six games and scored a run. Last year, she appeared in 15 and had five RBIs to go with five RBIs during the 2015 season. Lauren Warner. <laughs> Next up, she just got a complete game shutout, Maddie Boucher. Accompanied by Shannon and Sheila, Maddie leading the way this season, her ninth win, over 60 strikeouts and over 115 innings pitched, also picked up a save, had a two-hit complete game shutout over Cal State San Bernardino. She's posted over 30 wins during her collegiate career in the Navy and White. Last season, she was named to the GNAC All-Academic Team, Maddie Boucher. Next up, Carly Merritt, accompanied by Jade, Cindy, and Kelsey. Coming into this weekend, she's appeared in over 50 games for the Navy in white. Four wins in the circle for the Cavaliers during her career, including going 2-1 and one last season with a complete game one-hit shutout against Northwest Christian. She also picked up a win in the Cavs' victory over British Columbia in February. Number two, Carly Merritt. Next up, Megan Lupert. Megan accompanied by Penny, Justin, Haley, Taylor, her boyfriend Matt, Grandma and Grandpa Jan and Richard. Lupert will go down as one of the greatest softball players in Cavalier history. This season she was named to the NFCA Top 50 Players to Watch list, as well as being selected to the all-tournament teams at the Desert Stinger and Cavalier Classic tournaments. Last season she was named the GNAC Player of the Year as well as a first-team all-GNAC selection and a first-team academic All-American. Earlier this month, she was named Concordia's Outstanding Senior Student Athlete as well as the Female Scholar Athlete of the Year, Megan Lubert.
Next up, number eight, Taylor Bussey. Accompanied by her mom, Karen, her dad, Stu, grandma and grandpa, a Girl Scout troop, and a couple people who happen to be wandering by the park. Bussey has started in every game this season at shortstop, is batting over 350 with eight doubles and eight home runs. She's also driven in over 40 runs and scored better than 30 times with a slugging percentage over 600. Earlier this season, she was named to the all-tournament team at the Cavalier Classic, and last year was a first-team all-GNAC selection. Number eight, Taylor Bussey. And next up, Riley Zabarshuk, accompanied by Jennifer and Richard. Riley is a three-year letter winner who has started in every game this season, either in the outfield or at second base. She scored over 25 runs, hit three home runs this season. Earlier this year, she was named to the all-tournament team at the Cavalier Classic. Last season, she appeared in 54 games with 43 hits, including six doubles and a triple. In her last two seasons, she has stolen over 20 bases, including 11 this season. Number nine, Riley Zabarashuk. Congratulations to our seniors, now graduates, who will be hearing from the alumni office soon. And good luck to them in their future endeavors. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2017 seniors.